Hello everybody, this is John Seaglass 000 and I'm going to show you my seven Halo 3 weapons. Um, okay, so for Halo, you Halo fans out there, you'll love the certain weapon. Uh, you'll love two, three of the weapons. Okay, I'll start out with, I'll start out small and then I'll go big. I'll start out with the Halo 3 Magnum. Now, here's the Magnum. It has a clip. Here, I'll show you. Now see, there's a little clip right there has a real bullet that I shot. And yes, I know I'm cool since I shot a bullet. Now see, that's the clip. It goes in there. There's a little safety mechanism. Like, whenever you take out your gun in Halo, you go like that, and then you point it. And then, so that's safety. I have a little cocking mechanism, like a pullback. Look. Like that. So, in the game, if you're holding the Magnum, this is what it's going to look like. I'm going to take it out again, turn off the safety, and go like that. That's the Magnum. Currently, it's duct taped, and it's, it's four layers of thick cardboard. So that's how that one goes. Now to go on to my SMG. This is my SMG. Um, simple, duct taped, same kind of thing as my Magnum. See, this is my Magnum. They're both duct taped, silver duct taped, same thing. Here, I'll show you. All my guns have working mechanisms on them except for one of them. Now see, here's my thing. Now you know in the SMG there's a little clip right about there. A little clip right there. Well, you know you can take it out. Oh, oh, well, would you like, look at that, it comes out. Now it's held together by these two balsa wood sticks. One goes up, hot glued out and out, so when you push in, inside forward, it stays. So this is what it looks like in the game. Well, I can't really like, jerk it down and then like out so like it goes down and then out but this technically the reload looks like that in forward here's a here's um a little dual wield action that i like to call go like this and there you go now that's the dual wield and this is how you reload when you ever you dual wield see that's it nothing's nothing hard about it that's how you do it but in real life Here's how I would I would do. Grab, grab one clip, reload that. Grab another clip, and reload that. That's how I would reload if, if this was real life, but it's not. So get over yourselves. Now this is one that that was very hard to make. The Halo Three um, uh, Covenant Plasma Pistol. Here I'll show you the working mechanism on this one. Now see, I know it looks like it's the actual model, but it's not because it's cardboard. And I just printed out the picture right there too. But this is a little sp special part of it. Look, you charge it up and you shoot, and that thing pops up. Just gonna close that there. Here's another. Mm -hmm. See how that pops up? It's held together by like a swivel kind of thing, so so it can go like that. Cool, huh? So here's what it'll look like in the game. Oops. Sometimes it gets caught, but that's fine. So that's Halo 3 Covenant Plasma Pistol. Um, I'm going to start out. I'm, I'm going to go big. My Halo 3 Assault Rifle. This took five layers of heavy-duty cardboard. So I'll show you working mechanisms on this one. I know that it has words on it, but that's from the cardboard I had to use. Okay, so... This one has a little cocking mechanism, like that pullback thing that you see in the game. It has a little display thing, see that? Little 32 arrow and then times bullet thing. And then here's a little clip. Has a real bullet shell. Currently it's silver, but I think you see it as yellow, but here. So this is what it'll look like in the game. So it'll look like the beat down, the sideways beat down, and the upwards beat down, which is just your elbow going into them. Okay, let's see, look through your assault rifle. Detailed little bumpy edges down here so there's grip. Um, clip goes in here, pull back here, little display thing if you can see that. Good. Now I'm going to go to one that's my favorite that was very hard to make. 
Halo 3 Covenant Energy Sword. Covenant Energy Sword, able to cut through anything. This is stainless steel metal with a with a, cut, with a special plating that makes it look like it's rainbow. I'm gonna step back so I don't hit the table. So, Covenant Energy Sword, if you listen closely, you can hear it whistle in the air. This is metal, it's held together by it. This is metal, listen. So that's metal. It's all the metal is held together by this plastic hole screwed together. This is the Covenant Energy Sword. Simple, you take it out, and then that's that's what you got. The Covenant Energy Sword. Okay, that's the energy sword. Um now for my Halo oops. A Halo 3 shotgun. Now this is one of my favorites, because this one took a day, a whole day to make, but it actually works. Doosh, doosh, doosh. See the clip, the little shells pop out. Here, I'll show you the mechanism after this. Doosh, doosh. See, the shells pop out. Here, I'll show you how it works. Okay, so there's a little balsa wood stick in there that's angled, like, so when I push down, see how I like, so if, if if the clip was in there, as I push down, it forces it out. I I made three different kinds of blueprints to make sure that this worked, and a heck of a lot of glue and balsa wood. So pump, the thing slides out, push forces it out. I'm just gonna put that right in there. Put that in the, another one in there. Ooh. Yeah, see, that's the Halo Three shotgun. That's how this one works. Awesome, huh? Put that right there. Pick up the shells. I have four shotgun shells. I didn't shoot them, but like real shells. Middle bottom already shot. Um sadly this is the end of near the end of the video. This is not the end. I have the rocket launcher. So this is the last one. This is the, my last weapon. So Halo 3 rocket launcher. Simple. Not much to it. So this is how this one works. A little glue string, hot glue strings. So this is how it works. Halo 3 rocket launcher. See? Halo 3 rocket launcher. Go over it again. All I used was duct tape, PVC pipe, rolling paper, tubes hot glue and, and balsa wood blocks. So, yeah, that's about it. Here's a little shoulder place, handle, extra handle just for grip, and the rockets held together on this end right there. So that's my Halo 3 rocket launcher. Okay, I can't, okay, fine. If you guys really want to see the beat down for this, I haven't really, like, this will, this whole thing, this will open and this will slide out if I do the beat down, like where I tilt it down and this part will probably hit you. Here's what it'll look like. Imagine that this doesn't pop out and this doesn't open. Now for you fast Halo fans out there, if you want to reload fast with a rocket launcher in real life, if you were actually buying the Covenant, here's what you do. That opens, the thing falls out, grab another one, put it there. See? That's how I would reload. Um, please comment, please subscribe, please watch my other videos. Not, not all of them are directly related to Halo, but, you know, I'll go over them again. Magnum, plasma pistol, energy sword, assault rifle, SMG, Shotgun and the old faithful rocket launcher. So that's the end of my video. Please comment, please subscribe. That's just about it. So there we go. Thank you for watching. Bye.